this new shave today. How y'all doing today? Hopefully you're doing pretty good because I'm doing pretty good too. So I got a lot in this one and yeah, so there's going to be a lot of talking points in this one. So let's just get straight into what we're going to be using. DE brush we're going to be using, we're going to be going with my Kensurf DS Cosmetic 2019 Summer Edition brush. I thought this matched the uh, soap label pretty well. 26 millimeter tuxedo knot in there. So that is the brush that we are using. DE razor we're going with. I mashed a couple razors together. So this is the Meta Phoenix Artist and Accoutrements Metaphor Handle with Alien Green Tip and the top cap and base plate are the DOC Stainless Steel 316. And I already got it preloaded in there with a Wismet Super Iridium. So that is it. I appreciate it. we're gonna go with this Ice Tube 2.0. Put it all. Talking points. Now, a few weeks ago, almost a month ago, Rich Hansen, uh, Rich Man Shaving, reached out to me and he goes, you know, we're going to be releasing a soap and stuff and Splash. Do you want to try it before anybody else can buy it? And I was like, yeah, dude, right on. So, yeah, I was like head over heels, happy. He's like, all right, I'll give you the information later and we'll get on it. So, I got more stuff sent to me. So, Pete at Hendrix Classics and Company sent me a bunch of stuff, and I'll read this to you. <clears throat> it says, Chris, thanks so much. I hope you enjoy these things. I included a soap scoop and a mail call box opener. Thanks, Pete. So, with that, here's the box, or uh, here's the scoop. Looks like a spade, or looks like a flathead shovel. There's a spade shovel one too. Tobin's Throwbacks has one, like two of those. But yeah, that's the scoop, the shovel. And here is the box opener. Really cool. The cleaver. Got a big handle on there. It's like something your G.I. Joe's would use if you're a you know, little kid or action figures. Oh, open it up. Wow. Fitting for after Friday the 13th, right? Yeah. It looks like it's Damascus steel, but it's not really Damascus steel. It's got the HCNC on there. Really cool cleaver. And I also got scent. This, I smelt this at Razor Emporium. This smells really damn good. Oh, I don't know the scent prof profile on it yet. Haven't looked it up, brand new, but I got sent this. I gotta get the splash. Or if I just use one of my splashes that I have to match it with this, yeah. Damn good, damn good scent, so. Now, what are we going with today, though? So, this is a collaboration with Rich Hansen, Rich Man Shaving, and Hendrix Classics and Company. This comes out on Monday, October, Monday, October 16th at 10 a.m. Central Time. And it is... <clears throat> can't speak. Cosmic Gentleman. <clears throat> Sorry. Just woke up. It's 6 in the morning. <laughs> so, Rich Hansen actually came up with this label. It's the Metally label. Um, you got Planet Earth in back. Comment below, Planet Earth. And then it hits, fits right circly with that. And then you have this part's in color, this part's in color, the light's in color. This building in background is uh, blacked out. So this looks like a place you sit and hang out and drink coffee or I don't know. Planets in the back. I don't know what this building is. Is this like um, Kentucky Derby or something? I asked Rich what the building was, but he was busy with the Idaho meetup. So I don't know. If Rich, you're watching my video and you know, what is this building? I know there's, those are usually red, white, and blue. To hang off it's some sort of club i have no idea what that means so yeah that's what we're gonna be using today oh and this one is this is an homage to parfum parfums de marley carlisle i have no idea what that is never re didn't do research don't know what that is i've never used that company before so we're just gonna be going off of just this Scent profile is top notes are nutmeg, green apple, and saffron. The middle notes are tonka bean, rose. I'll put it right here. I can't read that. Asmanthus and davenin. Base notes are patchouli, vanilla, and opapanax. The soap is going to be soap and splash are going to be twenty two ninety nine, and the EDP is going to be thirty two ninety nine. Yes, I get the apple up front, and it's almost there's no smoke or there's no um tobacco in it but there's like a tobacco-y type the, the second note that i get is like it's cool it's like fresh 
It's apple-y, but it's also dark at the same time. It's kind of crazy. So, yes, Cosmic Gentleman. Today's Saturday, and there's going to actually be an uh, annular solar eclipse. You can see parts of it. It's going to go right through Oregon, Nevada, Utah, New Mexico, Arizona, and Texas. So, that's like sometime this morning, like 8 till 10. So, if you're on the West Coast, you might be able to catch it. Kind of fitting, right? Yeah, so... We're going to get this scooped up and I get this lathered up and I will be right back. All right, I'm back with the face. Oh, pre-shave cube, ice cube 2.0. Let's get this going. Yeah, the Idaho wet shavers, Northwest, Northwest Idaho wet shavers. That was yesterday. 14th. No, that's today. No, it was yesterday. I don't know. <laughs> I didn't go, so, yeah, I think it's today. Yesterday was Friday the 13th, but yeah, it's the 14th. So, yeah, it is today. I don't know. All right, rub that in. I know a lot of people are going, though. Rich Hansen, um, Matt Pasarsic from Razor Emporium. Caleb from Ellsworth is going to be there. Uh, Carlos is there. A few others, but I don't know. Banaka's there. Just from photos I've seen that people already po posted and stuff. Uh, Chris from Carve Razors, I know he's there. This guy Chris is not there though. <laughs> That's a long way for me to go. Idaho is up north. I'm in Arizona. Although I bet the weather is really, really nice though. Bam! Yeah, I get the apple right up front and then you get all the other stuff. It's like, it's darker. So it's not just straight up like Apple. Like I said, I don't know what Parfums de Marley de Carlisle is. No, Parfums de Marley Carlisle. So I didn't do any research on that. I am just using this straight out how it is. Just like if you were to use it and you'd never even heard of that company before either. So we're going to use it together. But it does come out on Monday. I believe it's going to be on the Hendrix Classics and Company uh, website. So, I'll put a link down below to the Hendrix and Classics Company, but it is not available until Monday. So, if it interests you, you got to look for it and search for it on the website. Oh, yeah, it's it's almost tobacco. I don't know what note that I'm picking up that I, it reminds me of, like, a tobacco-y, smoky, dark kind of scent. Is it the saffron? I don't know very notes very good. I've never smelt some of these individual notes on their own. But, yeah, it's apple -y. It's almost smoky. It's... Almost tobacco like, it smells good. Mm. And I'm flinging it everywhere. <clears throat> need a razor. So, yeah, alum on my fingers. Don't need it. So, like, yeah, about three, past number one, two or three weeks ago, yeah, Rich. Rich Hands and Rich Man Shaving hit me up, and I was like, heck yeah, dude. I was so through the roof. I was like, yes! Because, yeah, nobody ever sends me stuff. I buy everything. Usually almost all, everything I buy on my... Okay, I buy everything on my channel. If I don't buy it from the store or wherever, I get it second rate from somebody else, or I trade for some stuff. So nobody ever sends me stuff for free. Just one time... PA did the Tokyo Rose set, and I didn't know it was going to get sent to me. Other than that, nobody sends me anything. Halfway to 1,000 subscribers, and nobody sends me stuff. Not bitter or nothing, I'm just saying. I, I'm here. <laughs> oh, this is nice so far, though. Yeah, it's just, the apple hits me first, but it's not like... It's not, a, it's not like a fruity kind of scent. Like you think an apple, you're like, oh, it's going to be real bright and green apple. Those are like Granny Smith's. No, the other notes in there balance it out to where it's like apple-y, but it's dark too. It's blended really well. Oh, three days worth of growth. I did shave on Wednesday. I actually use Year of the Tiger on Wednesday. Year of the Tiger is a great, great scent too by Hendrix Classics. One of my favorites there that I have. 
In that shave, I use that. And I think a 7 o'clock black. And um, the carbon razor. But this is nice so far. Gone, gone, gone. Residual slickness, very good. Sharp combination, the blade and razor. I'm not gonna need a pass number two, so we're just gonna be doing one pass. Yes, the Idaho, I think the Idaho wet shavers is today. I'm thinking ahead for some reason. I don't know why. But yeah, I think it's today. So I've, uh, Banaka was posting photos that like there was a snake bite. Snake something uh, restaurant. That's how I see like some of the people there. Banaka Winaka. Alright, I'm good. That's a damn good shape. <laughs> That's a good combination, too. That's what we're going with. Very close, sticky smooth, BBS, die live. No nicks, no cuts, no weepers, problem area, nothing. Yeah, that's a, that's a damn good base. All right, clean up and I'll be right back. All right, so I'm back. Very close, very smooth, very efficient. I, Pete's, Pete's base is a good base. I'm not sure what the base is called, but it's a damn good soap. I do have, I have to clean up there is Nick or a weeper right there. There's some blood. Problem area? Nothing. All right. So, hey, I don't like See how this goes. Those wisdoms are really good. I bought a whole bunch of them. I think they're like 80 of them. Or 100. I don't know. I have made, I have pretty much like a year's worth, maybe two years worth of shaving if I used. I calculated it somewhere. Yeah, that burns right there. Got a cut there. Of course it burns. Um, if I use one blade, got the rubber band, that's what's, one blade a week, one blade a week, um, cat, quit, one blade a week for like a year or two, I don't know, it lasts a long time, all right, so, matching splash, we're going with Hendrix Classics and Company, collaboration with Rich Hansen, Rich Man Shaving, Cosmic Gentleman. Gentleman. Yeah. So this is an homage to Parfums de Marley Carlisle. I said a bit, like, yeah, I've already opened it. But how the splash, the splash is always different from the soap. Splashes are always usually more complex. Like all the stuff that it comes out. Yeah, because I get the apple right there. And the other note is dark. It's, don't let the apple fool you into thinking that it's like a fruity kind of scent. It doesn't smell fruity at all. You get the apple, then you get all the other stuff. Yeah, it's, it's apple-y and it's dark. Yeah, this is nice. Thank you very much, guys. <laughs> Thanks for including me. Cool. Yes. All right, clean up. All right. Recap of what we used today. We used my potato bowl, good color. My go-to bowl I always use. Unbreakable. Appreciated was Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Ice Tube 2.0. That's it. Also use DS Cosmetic Ken Surf 2019 Summer Edition Brush. 26 millimeter tuxedo knot. Two colors. I thought that fit the label really, really well. Razor, Metaphor, Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements, Metaphor Handle, Alien Green Tip, Top Cap and Base Plate are 316L uh, Stainless DOC, see Phoenix DOC. And we used a First Use Wismet Super Iridium. Yeah, you can see blood there right there. Got me right there. Also used, did I see Splash? Yeah, I said this flash right now, yeah, the first P 
PA Allen block. I don't know. <laughs> Pretty happy about this. This is cool. And other stuff we didn't use, but I got. Ladies Man from Hen Pita Hendrix Classics sent me that. And I did use the stoop. The <laughs> flathead shovel. There is a spade shovel too. Like I said, Tobin got two of them. And then the cleaver. <laughs> Open your boxes up. Really, really, really cool. And if you got an action figure, that'd be pretty cool if we put him in his hand. <laughs> and that's it. Star of the show today. From Rich Man Shaving, Rich Hansen, and Pete at Hendrix Classics and Company, we have Cosmic Gentleman. This is going to be available Monday, October 16th at 10 a.m. Central Time. You can see how much I scooped out of there. Yeah, it's it's apple. It's weird. It's apple-y, but it's dark. That's how I could describe it. I've never smelled uh, parfums in Marley Carlisle, but yeah, you get the apple, and then it's dark. Kind of cool, like it balances itself out. It's like, yeah, it does not smell like fruity and you're thinking apple. Very good. Awesome. So, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Rich Hansen, for reaching out to me and wanting me to do this. And thank you very much for Pete at Pete's, Pete at Hendrix Classics and, Classics and Company for sending me all this stuff. Kindness of your heart, dude. Thanks very much, dude. I, I really appreciate it. You're appreciated. Yeah, I appreciate you. I know that's a new thing. People say they appreciate you, right? Yeah. So, awesome. Hopefully, it'll be... Maybe you'll get some more stuff sometime soon. I'm not like a beggar or nothing, but... If you're going to send me something, cool. I will review it. And that is it. That's the save of the day, ladies and gents. Links down below. Like I said, this doesn't come out until Monday, though. So, if you want to look on the website on Monday, I'll put a link down below to Hendrix Classics and Company so you can check it out. And that is the shave of the day. That's a damn good one. Yeah, awesome. Very close, very smooth, very efficient. Yes, I'm going to be rambling and talking, but yeah. Um, when Rich told me he wanted to get me to get in on it so he could send me something before you guys could buy it, I was like, through the roof. Yeah, so awesome. Yeah, Rich Man's strong. So, hope you ladies and gents have a good day, good week, good shaves, more to come. And yeah, today's Saturday at 626. Go check out the uh, Eclipse if you can today, but be smart and wear those special glasses they have. And see you ladies and gents soon. Bye.